2022 was a great year for the space industry, with remarkable things happening all across the globe in the sector. From NASA's historic launch to SpaceX's record-breaking back-to-back launches, space almost became reachable. Entering 2023, SpaceX is maintaining that streak of doing wonders, and that's what we're going to talk about today. Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. In this video, we're going to talk about the recent developments that are taking place at SpaceX. Stepping into 2023, SpaceX has new records to make, and it seems like they are all set for that. So without any further ado, let's talk about it. Last year, SpaceX broke all the records for conducting the greatest number of launches in one year. It was SpaceX's Falcon 9 that brought this record to the company. There's no doubt that this workhorse of SpaceX is truly an amazing machine. While no one believed that there could be a rocket with reusable boosters, SpaceX did that and with recurring successful launches and landings of boosters. The agency has proved its mantle. Though it's not only Falcon 9 that has proved very useful, all three spacecraft, the Falcon 9, Falcon Heavy, and Dragon, which are the orbital class rockets of SpaceX, have bagged their own success making the company the biggest player in the industry. Where all these orbital class rockets which have time and again proved themselves are very important for the agency, there is another spacecraft that has grabbed all the attention. And yeah, you've guessed it right, it's the all new Starship rocket that has been the most anticipated machine the industry has ever seen. First, it's nothing like the previous spacecraft. How? That I will tell you in a bit but Elon Musk has a great role to play in marketing and hyping SpaceX's creation. Elon announced on his Twitter back at the start of 2022 that the world will be able to witness the launch of Starship in the upcoming 12 months of 2022. And while the whole world awaited for its launch, all we were able to see were the static fire tests of both the Starship and its booster. The promise of launching in 2022 is obviously not fulfilled by Elon Musk and his space company. However, the hype is not going anywhere. In fact, everyone is so excited because we know it is not late before we will be able to witness the historic liftoff of this revolutionary spacecraft. The thing that makes it so special is that it's nothing like any rocket previously seen before. There were times when no one believed that reusable boosters could be made, but SpaceX did that. With Starship, the agency has gone one step further and made the overall rocket reusable. This means if the agency was losing 30% of the rocket because it was non-reusable, that cost will be saved now, making space travel quite feasible and comparatively cheaper. That's not all. This new spacecraft is able to fuel mid-air and can transfer propellant from one Starship to another, which means we can now travel further into space using the Starship. All these features make the Starship a machine that has never been seen before. So, now that we know what this rocket is capable of, it's easy to understand why there's so much hype around it. In fact, SpaceX has such a foolproof portfolio that out of all the agencies in the world, NASA has awarded the company with a billion dollar contract of landing a man on the moon to SpaceX. It's quite a prestigious contract under which NASA is aiming to send astronauts back to the moon under its Human Landing System, or HLS program. There were a lot of companies that SpaceX was competing with, but NASA selected SpaceX because of its record and the work they've been doing in the industry. While it did make some of the competitors not very happy with the decision that NASA took, SpaceX's Starship is a very promising spacecraft. Once it lifts off, the world will be able to see what SpaceX has designed. You might be thinking, what's the new development that's happened? So, let's get to the point. Two major things recently took place at SpaceX's Texas launch site. First, SpaceX has fully stacked the Starship on its booster. It's SpaceX's Starship Prototype 24 that SpaceX has stacked over the Super Heavy Booster 7. Looking at that shiny stack is quite mesmerizing because it tells us how far humanity has come with technology. However, what was even more amazing to see was the four orbital launch vehicles from SpaceX standing vertically on four launch pads. Yeah, recently SpaceX loaded all four of its launch pads with vehicles on them, and trust me, there couldn't be a better sight. 
So, the question is why were all the launch pads loaded with the vehicles, and what plans does SpaceX have? Call it a coincidence or whatever, but all four spacecraft were there to serve some purpose. The Falcon 9 was loaded to lift off with the Starlink satellites while Falcon Heavy is all set to launch for the Space Force mission. While Dragon is also going to lift off soon, the previously sent Dragon capsule recently detached from the International Space Station and will soon be landing back on Earth with a huge splash. The Dragon capsule is coming back with a technological payload and huge research data that will help us understand more about the extraterrestrial life beyond our world. So it's not just the site that is brilliant, but everything that takes place under the roof of SpaceX is huge. Obviously the four spacecraft was the fully stacked 395 foot starship that is there to launch. Elon said back in mid 2022 that they need to conduct a few static tests of the starship and booster 7 before they can prepare the whole stack for the first orbital launch. Now that SpaceX has finally stacked the ship, it's very likely that the launch is very close. In fact, Elon Musk said that the launch is very likely to happen towards the end of February, though March is a must. Then again, when it comes to promises from Elon, we can't be sure of anything. No one blames SpaceX for the delay, because what they're sending into orbit is our hope to colonize Mars by founding sustainable settlements on it. So the delay is beneficial because it's important for the Starship launch to be successful rather than early. So, let's hope this time Elon doesn't have to back off with his promise, because it's been a while since we've been waiting for the Starship launch. If it goes successful, one day, we might be able to witness four simultaneous launches of the Starship. When that day comes, it's going to be amazing. So, that's a wrap on the video. I hope you liked it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.